DJ cut the beat like we do we did like while and uh conceited but welcome back welcome back y'all boys outside the box with your boy box and uh this is episode 10 y'all boys and if you made it this far thank you for tuning in make sure you like subscribe comment do all that on every platform let me know if it's trash bro i need to i need your help bro because if you don't like it i need to know what you don't like so i keep doing it so you can tell me to keep stopping uh i got my nigga jonas with me this week i'm here he finally brought me i took him 10 episodes <laughs> 10 episodes <laughs> You know what's ten? That's this moment. <laughs> it took him ten episodes to get me here, but I'm happy to be here. <laughs> and we got the infamous Sabine, y'all boys. If you was a true listener from episode one, we gave her a shout out. Sabine, welcome. Hey everybody, it's Sabine, not Sabine. So. All right, y'all boys, let's jump in. Let's jump in. Yeah, um, I know if you tuned in last week, last week was a uh, interview stop, but we back. We back with the jokes. We back with the comedic style. Y'all feel me? But um, this week. Coronavirus has been killing shit, y'all boys. Literally. Like, yo, my tape. As y'all can see, I need a haircut. I'm You're dying. One. I'm looking <laughs> bad. It's, it's good. I think I'm gonna cut my own haircut. No, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Really? I don't think you have the, the you know. The wits? No, the, the rhythm. The rhythm of the beat? Because you gotta have rhythm to, to cut hair. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> you just cut like you just, you just go. Oh, you gotta have rhythm. Well, what if you push it back? Push your tape all the way back. I'm not gonna mess with the tape. I'm just gonna get the hair. Oh, you're just lowering the hair. Oh, that's, that's easy. I thought you were gonna line yourself up. Hell no, I'm smart, bro. That's not a good idea. I ain't trying to get caught. Y'all boys stuck up on toilet paper though. That wow. made no sense to me. Right? The the toilet paper thing. Like, you know what I thought? You know what I think it was? I think is when people see. Uh, X amount of people doing one thing, mm. they just start following. So it had to take a specific group of people to start doing it. Because toilet paper really didn't have anything to do with this virus. I don't know, we had to do it for real. They probably think, like, in a crisis, like, I had to take a shit, but there's no more toilet paper, and I can't go outside because it's like during walking the quarantine, dead. People still going out. That's it the point. They're not sense. supposed to. For essential activities. And what's essential activities, in your opinion? What is that? Sex is essential. <laughs> <laughs> You don't have the essential activities that you have to leave your house for. For right now, it would only What if you don't got the person with you? See? Good point. Yeah, you got to go get your sex. That's not essential? Nah, not really. <laughs> See, kid, we're going to quarantine for like six months. Okay, then. Ah, uh, nah. Well, okay. I'm not going to say that. I'm just going to say that. But it's crazy that that was the first thing that you thought of. That that's the yeah, most essential thing. Right? It kind of is. <laughs> okay, so if you have three, wait. if you only could name three essential activities, what would they be? All right, sex is number one. Because without, stress, we're gonna be, without sex, we're going to be stressed out and angry. So I don't want to be angry. Some people relieve stress another way, so. Okay, people, cool. people could, like, what about people who on who celibate and practice those type of things? They it wouldn't really bother them then. If you know you're celibate or you're a virgin, it would But that you. just shows that you can go without sex. That's they can, the they point. can go without sex. Ah, everybody can go without sex. You think so? Yeah. Um, I don't know. Her. Come on, any anybody can go without sex. Kid, yeah, you can't masturbate forever. <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't need sex to survive, yes. It is essential. But it is a human desire, yeah. you know what I mean? Imagine all of us, no climax for six months. Bro, we all angry. Yeah. It's going to be the real walking dead because of this virus, huh? I disagree. So you'll be enlightened <laughs> for six months, backed up, can't get out. And you in the house, you stuck. Bro, I'm, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not going there. <laughs> Why? What do you mean? You, you, you're staying in the box because you know we outside the box. We are outside the box. So you got to go outside, bro. You need some Henny in your cup? <laughs> I do got Henny in my cup. Oh. All right, what's, what's another essential activity? Mine is going to work. So just work? But but that's yours. Everybody yeah. can go to work. For me. What's your top three? Sex? I got, I got sex, work, because you need to make money. Sex, work, and then like... Dang, what's my last one, Ken? Central. Sex, and work, if it's if food, dealing with food, health related. Sex, work, food. Go get food. And health. But I think essential is relative. Because what's essential to you won't be essential to me. For me, it's sex don't have to be one. But, <laughs> but during <laughs> a pandemic? 
that's that's one. Come on. Um, obviously, um, going out to get you know items like toilet paper and food, and I feel like I gotta see my friends. I need social interaction. The corona-free ones. How you know who got it? <laughs> exactly. So let, you... me, let me tell you what happened this morning. Mm. This morning, Drop it on me and Ricardo wanted to go do something, and we went inside the guy's house. He had a, a, a thermometer reader that you point at, the ones that they use for cooking, mm. to point at our foreheads. And our temperature was normal, obviously. But you could do that. I don't know if it was high. But yeah, don't some people them. don't show symptoms. Yeah, some people don't show symptoms. That's they just have it. Part. So... Yeah. Then y'all peep how um, Takashi got free because of the coronavirus. That's that makes no sense to me. Right? This this 2020 crazy. I'm man. happy he's he's free. What? I him. What? Don't get me wrong. I, I second that. I miss, I miss his miss antics, him. but I don't yes. miss him as a person. His antics on how? social media, because he's very funny. He well, could have stayed is. there though, but he took down. He took other people lives. Bro, so. I. I that, that's the thing that bothers me. If, yeah. if, if he was actually doing really things, real things that was wrong, then yeah, he, he should have sat in prison, no matter yeah. what it was. Well, but he really, I mean, he ended up, what, what was the story? He found out that people in his crew wasn't really down for him. So you expect him to stay loyal or true who, to the who, game? Who if fought is that? Somebody. Well, you put That's what he signed up for. That's what he signed up for. But they did too. Who? Why you? Why you like everybody in his crew? But then they oh, say yeah, that. Right. Then they say that they chose him to be the face of something. Yeah, like to. And he was just a part of the antics that yeah. they were doing, or the illegal things. Um, he was part of it because he was he was calling him to go do hits for him. Like, oh, go shoot and, this. In my opinion, they shouldn't be mad at what he's doing. I don't think Cause so. Because if you go pick up if you go pick up some dude that's a little bit popular on the street with no street cred, and now when you know when things hit the fan, he's squealing. Why y'all surprised? I don't know why. I don't think they surprised, but they thought he would have did a little bit better. No, I, you think, know? I, don't I think they surprised. They probably no, they probably would have thought considering because they they also supported him a lot too, yeah. with like you know protection and. And making him famous to what he is now, but at the same time, it's like. But in the long okay. run, they would they were still from him. Listen, so. I want to say I want to say at least eighty-five to ninety percent of dudes, mm. when things hit the fan, they're gonna snitch. Yeah, cause good especially thing I ain't a dude, cause I don't go. You snitch off the rip, right? You snitch. Keep it up, you snitch. I'm snitching on everything. I Even gotta, if, the, if I got right a that. jit at home, yo, y'all not coming before my jit. That's cool. Takashi but... got a jit. He got his OG. Mm -hmm. True. Like, come on, so and he's like right the bread right. maker. That's cool, but I'm at the snitching. same time, it was don't put yourself in that situation. Exactly. So, like, let's say your your nigga, your boyfriend that you recently got during this quarantine. Oh yeah, congratulations. Oh. Yeah, so <laughs> congratulations. <laughs> She's off the market now. But, um, like, let's say your boyfriend like a drug dealer. But you know this. You're with him. You got love. Now you go down because you know. And you live in the house and y'all spend the money. Are you, you holding it down or are you snitching? Well, that's a great question. And I'm going to answer by, that question by that's saying this. Though. I'm not going to put myself in that position. Like, where I'm at right now... Mm. At this age, I know what I want in life. And if my boyfriend was into anything like that... You're leaving him. I'm straight. I would even be in a relationship with you. Mm. Okay. Yeah. I got too much to lose. You wise. A lot of people ain't got nothing to lose. A relationship is different, though, being compared to people that, you know, is on the street. What do you mean? That's like, true. okay, if it's a significant other, you're less inclined to snitch. But if it's people on the street... You'd be like, oh, I can meet somebody like him next month. I don't really care. Like, what, sure. what you do, you order that person. You get what I mean? That's Compared true. to a significant other. And how much how much you got invested with yeah. that person that you don't, what, like, you do with a significant but that's, other. But to me, I just go by, like, random people. If I don't know you and you did a crime, I'm snitching. But, like, if I really know you and you did a crime, nah. I think the general rule of that whole thing is if you're going to live that life, live it 100%. True. You that's it right there. That's if you're going to do that's it, true. live it 100%. You won't kill somebody. And do your snitch. dirty work by yourself. That's the best way. But they're not going to do it like that when you're that popular. Jeez. Yeah, he can't do it himself. Well, he like, if, I give, if you become a millionaire, you can't do the shit you want to really do to people. True. What time are you going to have? Yeah. Just give me a fuck. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to come out of the studio and then go kill a nigga. What schedule is that? <laughs> Between nine and five. <laughs> That's crazy. We murder niggas. <laughs> I can't, I can't imagine living that kind of life. That's crazy. How y'all think his time in jail went? 
Shoot, I know he was stressing. If that's not the life, no, that's not the stress part. Nigga, I'm talking about how that booty. Oh, you was once a correction officer, so you you know. From 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 my knowledge, he probably was uh, in protective management, so not probably probably a lot of people wasn't able to get access to him, or but he has money. Isn't that more crazy though? Like, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it worse? Like, because R. Kelly probably got that. Because they could put him in protective management when he's around other people, Mm. or they could put him in protective management when he's isolated. I don't know which one he did, Mm. but either way, he's still good. He has money. Like in prison, money runs it. Like you got money, you get anybody to do anything for you. They don't. They don't care if you snitch. You got money, we cool. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy, Zoo. Isn't they trying to um, get Kodak because they know he got money in there, giving him a hard time. Yeah, they was when first got locked up a couple a couple bids ago, but I think they was recently saying that too. What? Really? Yeah. Not the inmates though, the CEO. Yeah, the CEO. Yeah, the yeah. CEOs is yeah. giving them a hard time. I'm talking about the inmates. The CEOs won't percent. give anybody a hard time. They don't care who you are. So they really taking booty in there though, or is it like a voluntary thing? To my knowledge, it, it, it goes both ways. You can volunteer it, or we're gonna take. <laughs> Funny. It's really it's, sad. You know, you know, I can't. Mean, it's sad that you know they're in that situation. I don't think so. Yeah. If, if they get it taken, like damn. How they got in that situation? Okay, that's true. Mm-hmm. Exactly. But some people, I'm the type of person. I don't just judge you by where you at. I kind of like analyze your situation and like look at people for what they might have been through in their past to cause them yeah. to be where they at in the present, mm. you feel me? Okay. So you can't just say like, oh, well, you did something. You don't know where that person mind was or what they've been through or if they had to do it, whatever they did, you feel me, so. But it's still two things though. One, you control every action you do. That's mm-hmm. true, but some don't know better. And two, I think it depends on what you did. Yeah, see, some don't know better. That's why some I think some people, better. some people go to jail, like the, the people that be taking the booty, they be gay, so they go to jail to be freely gay. You, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's, 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 that's crazy that you would know, man. No, that, I ain't, I'm, I'm not buying that. I'm sorry. Think about it. Okay, think about it. Let's say, like, I've been going to Justin, like, because you, know, you got to think about it. Some people get life in jail at, like, an early age. You're done. So you you automatically think you're going to go gay. But let's say I've been going to jail since, like, I was, like, 13. So after a while, all I know is jail life. I probably got my f- first dick getting sucked oh was in gosh. jail. True. Or anything, because you're always there. So soon as <laughs> you're going to just give in. So it's like, after a while, if I've been in there from 14 to 25, I'm doing three years, four years, and I'm, 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 I'm involved in gay shit. After a while, that's where I want to go do my gay shit, because when I get you, out. Is that you personally, or is that just what you're saying? Well, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, because after a while, you're like, I want to be gay, but you don't want to be gay out here. So you're like, you know, you know what I'm be telling people? Be gay in there. There's two types of gay dudes in prison, mm. and Joe. It's the ones that... Is, is playing out gay. You, mm. you, you, when you get out, you still gonna go mess with dudes. You're gay, that's just right? Gay. That's, and then it's that's gay. Down. And then it's the dudes that they're in prison and what they're doing is gay, but mm. they're just doing it for the sexual gratification. It's still mm. gay. Yeah, it's still gay. But I, cause, but when they get out, they're not gonna go mess with dudes. They're gonna go mess with women. But that's what I'm saying. They go. I think those people are more prominent to go do something else to go back when they just get to get back. Yeah, to when they, yeah. But they got women when they get out. I ain't gonna lie, I, I was thinking about that this week, right? So I was like, girls say other girls eat them out better, right? So I was like, do that go for niggas too? Like, do niggas drop that neck better than. To be honest, that's niggas? not my area of expertise. <laughs> 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 And I never will. <laughs> so, that's why I'm lost. Okay, I'm fine now. Yeah, sorry, fam. That's why I'm lost. I was thinking, I was talking to the gay person. I was like, yo. I feel like when they um, keep going back to just because they know, like, they probably was the man in there, and when they come back out here, it ain't, they ain't nobody. the same yeah, yeah. title. So but it's, it's, like, it's not necessarily just the gay, though. A lot of them institutionalized. Yeah. Like that's, some, that's the main thing. Some inmates, they get off, they get, they on the street. They got no mm. health care. They got no benefits. They can't do nothing. They got no food. They then really you don't come know what out, they're you got to compete with everybody else. Like, in they, in they mind, they got to get where everybody else is at, forgetting that they, mm. they, they just got set back. Jail is also comfort zone. Like, I it's just easier. did 10 years, now I uh. come out. 
oh, what's, what's this? What's that? That's how they do this now? You feel me? It's like, oh, no, nah, I'm just going to go back to prison. I know no, how it works. Don't they pay for being in jail, too? Yeah. Which is crazy. What, per, what you mean? Like, like, per person. Like, you pay for oh, each yeah, day yeah. you're in jail. It's like, it's like what, 40000 a year per inmate, What? Bro. Yeah. They have to pay 40000 a year? Yeah, they get, like, 40000 a year per inmate. That's why they, like, just putting people in prison. What the fuck? <laughs> Why would I want to go to jail and not have to pay for that? It's a big organization. But you know how much it costs to kill an inmate that's on death row? Hold on. Almost like six figures. Why? That injection costs. That's why those dudes, they'll be on death row for like 30 years before they actually get killed. So why don't you just shoot them? It's a bully. It's, it's, it's unethical. That's crazy. I was immoral. talking to Killing them in general is unethical. An ethics class. What, what are you crazy. talking about? Go elaborate. What he just said. What, what death row? Yeah. Um, how how, how they it? will let you sit for years. But then again, it's not just because it's expensive. It's also, it's an appeal process. Like, you get like three or five appeals. One appeal will take like five years. What's your thoughts on death row? Shoot, I feel like we're not in a, no place to take nobody life. Mm. True. So we not, we ain't nobody to be we're taking nobody we life. We can't say who does, who lives and who dies. But at the same time, I think a life for a life. If you if you willingly kill somebody, don't be surprised if your life get taken. Don't be mm. surprised, but I mean, who are we to say? Yeah, you going I'm gonna kill you. No, I'm not gonna kill nobody. No. So you. So yeah, y'all are opposed of it. Yeah, I'm against it. Against death row, yeah. yeah. Because you could just give them life in prison. But life in prison, to me, is still death row. It is, yeah. cause in, in in some form, it's, you die slow. Well, after a while, you gonna get. But I kind of even like, feel like, what is prison doing for them? What you mean? It's like you see, over, overseas, what is, they, what is prison is a reform. Yeah, prison here is horrible. Exactly. It's a reform. Prison it's not here just is incarceration. horrible. Yeah. Exactly. That's why overseas, like, when people get out, they really never go back in unless they got mental issues. Kid, I was watching a show um, on Netflix about, well, um, I forgot what country it is, but this girl's in prison. They get to keep their jit till, like, if they got pregnant early, they get to keep their jit in there with them till about three. And they got, like, their own little cell, own little everything. It's a daycare there. Everything. You learn a trade while you're in jail. I'm like... It's in the UK. Yeah, I'm like, why the hell we don't do that? Because this is America. <laughs> <laughs> this is America. <laughs> so I'm like, bro, imagine... And then, you know, like, I think UK, too, like, you don't... If you have a JIT, the girl don't have to go to work till the JIT five years old. Like... Maternity leave here is what six months, I think it's the most. Horrible. Let me tell you, what, six or three. It's like three to six. There should be maternity leave and paternity leave because it takes two. Yeah, and you can't they do the father too. Yeah. But I think the father up to like two years old. But like two over years. here, the father is like what? Two, no, three months. Shit. I ain't get shit. <laughs> I shit. No, because I had a, I had a sergeant in my job. He was gone for three months. They gave him three months paternity leave. Oh man. shit, my job. But that's still shit. nothing. Three months, bro. The jet just not breaking in, huh? That's what I'm saying. And they be annoying that. Yeah. They do have a smell. Oh, I love it. Babies? Yeah, yeah. Yes. That baby smell is good. I never knew it. That yeah. thing is addictive. But what is that? I like, don't know. Like I see them recreate all types of smells. Yeah. They recreate black ice. They recreate all these extra smells. Why I can't recreate a uh, new baby? Because that's what? Richard now. Eric yeah. Badu yeah. made her pussy her, smell. Her what? Eric Badu. She made her oh yeah, that's true. That's she crazy. made it. Yeah, you smell good? Too. I don't know. Why they buy that shit? I don't Creeps know. bought it, man. Yeah, why would you want to buy somebody that's, that's smell it? I mean, what, what, is it her natural scent or is it like... That's she said she burned her panties. Oh. Yeah. That's so it's she... not like burnt fabric. I would believe. I don't think it... <laughs> Wait. I don't think it... <laughs> She burnt her panties. Because I, I don't think you can get so much out of burnt panties. That okay, so after you... See, these, these are the things that we need to know. Mm -hmm. You burnt the panties so what, they grab the air I don't and know. put it in the bottle? The freak How do they make fragrances? Is it, isn't it like juices? It's liquid, yeah. Yeah, so... I don't know how they got the... Nah. Unless they got her juices in the bottle. That's disgusting. <laughs> That's disgusting. You think so? The fact that it's sold out is even more disgusting. <laughs> it's sold out fast. <laughs> it's like, like, it's so people bad. bought it quick. Who do you think buying it? Black, white, white people. It's white people. It is. Yeah, white it's people. the white people. Yeah, yeah, white people. Yeah, white people. White people love it. It was a white person who started it. She did it to Erica. And they're like, oh, shit. I could do this shit, too. White people are doing dumb ass shit. Just like they <laughs> let dogs eat them out, as we talked about on episode eight. You got a price to me? Would you Would you do that? No. So you would have, you would have, you would have. I would, I told you, if it's for some M's, if we talking M's, 
This guy yeah. says five Bs. Five Bs. Bro, come on, boy. Come on. Five five bees. Bees. You want that dog lick your balls for five Bs? For five hundred? Five hundred. No. Nah, it's, it's the protection between the dog tongue and my... It, it's not going to touch your dick at all. Just your balls. Oh, my balls? Yeah, just your balls. Of five Bs? Five Bs. Oh, <laughs> Five Bs? Give it to 20. I want it in 20s. <laughs> I can feel like I'm balling. <laughs> when I leave, no. I the gas. Give me some M's. I'm so stop. Five B's. Just no, but that's different, though. Five that's not actual. That's female's actual vagina. For us, it's just our balls. It's not yeah. like it's the shack. All right, what about your meat? No, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta run up the bread a little bit. Right on the tip. Not doing nothing. Not, no, I don't know about it. And they not, they're not going. <laughs> no, that's the life we're going in there. Yo, no, this you know your meat gonna sweat up. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. What's it called? My baby. <laughs> hey, no. But it, white people do it all the time. Mm-mm. White girls have sex with their dog. I seen. Yeah, y'all seen that before you the BCI. Yeah, you never seen it on mm-hmm. back in the days online when the white girls get fucked by a dog. What have you been watching? I seen them get fucked by a horse, which is just crazy because a horse is my goodness, big. man. Yeah. They blessed. Wow. I don't know why they blessed. Stallion. I'm talking about the horse. That's why I make like stallions. She's huh? smart. Okay. No, she a stallion. She's the stallion. Not Meg she likes stallions. Like <laughs> <laughs> the stallion, it's in the name. Well, she built like a horse, nevertheless. Yeah. Oh my goodness! <laughs> she, she, she built. She, 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 That's a big woman. Not big like it's in big. She's she's she stature tall? wise, yeah. She's yeah, like she nine three. Nine three. <laughs> <laughs> she's nine three. So. Hey, Fox, keep it a bug. You think you could date a woman taller than you? Like crazy taller than you. I can fuck. Like Yao Ming? What's your name? Yao Yao Ming? That's different. You said crazy. I'm talking about like... Meg might be taller than me. Probably. What, you like 5'8"? Yeah, sure. Can you date a girl that's like 6'4"? Nah. Nah, I can't can't do it. I'm gonna be hurt. Every time I talk to her, I gotta look up. That's tough. She gonna slap (laughs) (laughs) me. Shut up, nigga. (laughs) How does sex work? She gonna pick you up. That's a big woman. No, I can't. Do it. I, I can't date a guy shorter than me. And you know what's the annoying? Short. Being short, a short, like being short, short guys feel like you're automatically gonna want them because yeah, you're short. Yeah, eye level. Come on, no. <laughs> they can't get no. anybody taller. No. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, 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 I'm thankful to say I'm blessed for my height mm. because being short ain't it. It's not. No. I don't even like being short as a female. But it's okay for women. I in don't my like opinion. it. Yeah, it look weird when they be too tall. I don't like it. Six foot. I, I think after five five, you, you push it. I, I would like. And it's like you know when the, here's what blows me. I like feet. Mm. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Mm. Uh-huh. You got you, so, you into feet like you got feet fetish. Yeah, I got. I, I don't mean, I got a foot fetish. Toe? Excuse me. He suck toe. So so he sucked, oh, he sucked toe, toe, guys. Toe. He sucked for my second toe. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm not sucking toe. Why not? Is. Why oh, not? You got to put a toe in you my know. mouth. Oh, you ain't no real foot fetish. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There's, level, there's levels to this, okay? Okay. First off, feet can never be 100% clean because it's touching the ground That's a lot. That's your dog. Okay, what do you mean? Because it's my left, let me know. Yeah, as soon as she get out of the shower. Okay, I, I could, you know, come on. I mean, I you could, you know, you know, you could lick the feet. But second toes, come on, man. You buds. You not second toes? Yeah. You, go, you, you second go, go. toes, boy? Nah, hang on the door. Y'all really not sucking toes? Yeah, I'll probably do it one day, but I ain't doing it no time soon. You doing it? Yeah. Okay, come I've on. I've never done it yet, though, but I'll do it. I'll do it. Uh, I've never done it yet. You, you have done before to, to you before? Yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> like, how, how do that pop off? It's like a during sex thing, you just, like, the one leg up, you know, I'm looking at it. Uh, what does it feel like? Feet. Yeah. It just... I don't think it's more of that. It's just like, you feel me? As a female, you just want for your man to love every part of you. So you asshole too? So That's so boring. Asshole no, too? it's true. Like, so if boring. my dude is... Asshole too, Sabine? It's part of it's, it. Come on, what is it? That's it's not part of it. It's not part of it. gonna go down that block, yeah. you feel me? Just ride down the whole street. <laughs> come on, be fine now. I'm just, you said every part of your body. What if he ear you out and he like, oh he slide down? Oh my guys. Can we know? So, have you had it done before? What? My toes, No, yes. your ass. <laughs> I'm about to stop. Let's talk about the pooper. <laughs> the pooper. <laughs> the pooper. Oh, uh, you had it done. I've done it before. Oh my Wait, God. you've done it before? Mm? No. You ate the booty? Mm? Listen, I had no oh business back then. Oh my It wasn't for too long, though. 
It was it by accident? No, no, no. It was a conscious decision. Was it warm back there? Um. Did it smell like booty? No, no, no. She had just like got out of the shower. Booty or doo? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she had to get out of the shower though. But it was like a. Smell? It was like a. You know, I was like uh, I'm here. Did you like it? Yeah, I wouldn't not not do it again. I would. Exactly. As a man, you should be focused on pleasing your. So woman. what if your man wanted? The more you please her, the more she would want to do. What if your man wanted? That's oh, such hell crap. No. That's a of crap. What? No. Why? What's wrong with y'all girls? Why you want to please your man if your man likes his booty getting ate? I'm sorry, booty. sir. I'm sure he could find a man who would want to eat. That's that crazy, y'all. That means you, you selfish. I'm not That's the same word I use. Why would he want his booty ate? He likes it. it exactly. Feels good. You like your booty ate? No, I don't want anything Do done like with my ass. Negative. Okay. We're not your man. man that it just happens my to be My man wouldn't want his booty ache. How you know? Yeah, your current man. But if you had a man <laughs> and he wanted his booty ache, what you do it? You want to please your man, right? He do everything else. No. You know uh, what? What you just said is false. Mm. You said if a man does everything for a woman to please her, she's mm. going to want to please him more. Mm. So if he's doing everything to please you more, why you can't do it to please yeah, him Yeah, but why your form of pleasing, why you want me to eat your booty? Why you want him to eat yours? I didn't, I'm not saying I want him to eat mine. <laughs> I'm saying I won't knock it. And that's what you know. <laughs> Come on, man. I won't knock it. What I'm not going to tell him no. Okay, okay. We hear you. We hear you. Nah, that's selfish. I don't want no dookie on my... <laughs> my Why is it going to be dookie? What if he just got out of the shower? I'm okay. And y'all want me to say, oh, boy, the booty holes be stained or dirty. Why? We yeah. You heard like that before? <laughs> <laughs> we do just like y'all. Everything y'all do for that, we do it. I, I don't know. I don't be saying that. That's an exit. Not a, nothing else is back there. A booty hole, a man, and me... Not, just not going down. Go. I just don't see. I don't. I just don't see the position a man can be in. He gonna be dead. To get his over booty it. ate. Yeah. That's manly. In that's my manly. Opinion. Yeah, that shouldn't make no sense to me. He could lay on his stomach. And it was <laughs> spread his legs. Yeah, yeah. yeah hold it. You gonna find a man? No, man. Hard. Hard. Hold it. man. Imagine you get on hard. Now your meat in the bed. <laughs> no. Ain't got no more. No, no, no. No, man. Come on, dude. No. There's no way a man like you. You're manly in your. Can you even respect your man after that? No. What if it's done involuntarily? But, but them blunts, no, though. No, I'm punch you in the face. No, I'm not. <laughs> We're fighting. Like, what, what you doing? What if, what if when it's done involuntarily, it feel good? He's like, oh, shit. No, yeah. no. Sir. He got to go and catch one on a good mold. <laughs> Listen, first Whoa, off. Whoa, you going to shock yourself. First off, they can't just immediately go there. They either going to either try to ease their way down there. And why they, listen, it's like, while you going down, the alert, my alert meter is going, hey, 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 what you doing? You feel me like, hey, you gotta stop. You're going too far. So your alert meter be high when you're on your balls. Because what if she just like take your balls and just, you quick? No, because you know. She gonna give you a quick lick. No, because you know you got the gooch. Ah. That gap, that yeah. gap between the balls. What about that? You, you ever had that, didn't you? No, I've never had that, unfortunately. The gooch? The gooch. Yeah, the gooch lip. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You don't know what the gooch is? Mm, I don't know. Ah, yeah, so the gooch is like, it's the area between your balls and your asshole. Okay, so females have one too. No, uh, yeah, in a way, yeah. The vagina? In a way, yeah. In between the but vagina. But it's probably not as sensitive. Yeah. It's like, sensitive? Guys like know. that. Some guys like For it. For you guys. I don't know. <laughs> but you said it's probably not as sensitive, so I'm asking. Yes, because our ball sack is sensitive. That's why I would say that it's sensitive, but you guys, you know. Oh. You know, I'm not an anatomy major, man. Come mm. on, cut me some slack. Exactly, exactly. So, uh, I have, I'm taking anatomy, and I haven't discussed the gooch. Would you do that to your man, the gooch, at least? Do, why? What do you mean, why? We just told you. <laughs> like, it feels good. Selfish, you're selfish, man. Yeah, girls, I want to. You're a selfish man. partner. I'm not doing the booty, the gooch. Wow. The, the, you know what's crazy? I guarantee you, if the gooch was called a different word, you wouldn't get it. <laughs> I guarantee if you. If it was in the same location that you guys are describing, <laughs> hell no. What the hell? You know what's called something different? It's because it's called gooch. I mean, gooch makes it sound yeah, bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. Like, ooh, oh, the gooch. <laughs> the gooch. Let me get the, the gooch. Let me get the gooch. I'm doing the gooch. <laughs> no, no, man. Oh, they, ha- they have no business, though. Nah, no, oh. Come on. All right, y'all, boy. Let's jump in on the um the Tiger King documentary, y'all boys. <laughs> like, what you got from it? What you got from it before I take off? Um, I feel like. 
all of them aren't wrong. You feel me? No, nah, we hate Carol fucking Baskin. Oh, that's what you was looking for. Uh, that's the answer. Okay. <laughs> Let me know you hate her. I, I ain't gonna lie, Carol. She a sneaky you. one. I ain't that gonna dumb, lie. That dumb dick. Everybody should be scared of Carol. Yes. On God. Yes. Carol the devil. That don't sound like a trustworthy name. <laughs> hey, Carol? Well, Carol. Carol. Yeah, and she Carol white. Man. So let me keep it worse. Like, Carol mm-hmm. Black. I and she got this demeanor. No, absolutely not. <laughs> Carol Black? A <laughs> Black Carol? No. Yeah. We got no business. You could give her a pass, but white Carol, hell no. No, yeah. yeah. Off the jump, I don't believe. You know what threw me off? The, it's the fact that she said she don't think that the animals should be living in these cages. Mm. And if you go to her site, that's what she doing. The cages are worse. They're even worse. They're smaller. Mm-hmm. Like it's crazy. So where was she getting these tigers? Yeah, yeah, you ain't watching. I think so. they they, they per- I mean, her. She said She's, she was rescuing. So yeah, let me explain but, to you. Okay, so boom, <clears throat> Tiger King. He buy tigers and breed them because it's not illegal for you to own a tiger, but mm-hmm. it's illegal to yeah, breed all states it. or all states. So I don't know if they changed it ever since everything. What's the cause? Like two bands. Yeah, yeah. bands. Bad. Too bad, but you get a baby Five. one. Too bad. You want to get it as a baby, so of course. yeah. So he he do it and he got like the little zoo. Mm-hmm. But the thing is, see what she mad at is because. They like to breed them a lot because they make more money off the cubs, and tigers only stay cubs for. Like, oh, so he breed them to sell them. No, just for the to the zoo, so you could. Oh, be, for attraction. Yeah, so you okay, could do okay. um, cub petting, and but he it's sells like them too. he sell them too after they get a little bit too big. But cub petting is only like a couple weeks, so they gotta keep them coming. So she don't like that. Now, <coughs> she go and open the same thing. The only difference <coughs> is she say, "Oh, I got rescued animals." That's it. And then she doesn't pay her employees. She, They got to pay the employees. At least. She don't pay them. She does the same thing. And she benefits a lot of money. I think they said she make like a billion or 1.5 million or 1.5 billion. I'm not too sure. But wait, so how did employees get there? Did they, they volunteer? volunteer? All right, so if you, if you know you volunteer, you can't be mad because you ain't getting no, 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 they're not mad. Come on, but, but still like, like labor? Okay, but yeah. how am I hate on you? Like for you doing this, I'm, I'm trying to shut you down, mm-hmm. but I'm doing the same exact thing. Oh, so she's she's saying one thing but selling it the other. Exactly, she's selling it. Oh, oh I'm gonna rescue. I'm nice. Come look at mine. No, don't go to his. He do cub petting. He breeds. It's like you do the same thing, bro. You just running the scam on the boys. Then she killed her husband. Well, it's it has not been. <laughs> yeah, she killed that nigga. This, this, that's how everyone feels. She's guilty until no, proven innocent. Yeah, it's no evidence. To so you think say. you think she didn't kill him? I feel like she killed him, but oh, okay, then. she killed him. Her oh, husband I, was a part of her thingy, or he wanted to divorce her. Like he, he was he, rich. He was in, <clears throat> in it too, but he was he was trying to do his yeah. own thing. If he did that, then she no good. He wanted to divorce her and take his. He was working on a way for her to get no bread for him at all after the divorce. Mm-hmm type of thing it's and then freedom. he was supposed to leave one day just di- when Kitty he was just about disappeared. to leave then he just disappeared off the face of the planet disappeared. yeah just disappeared she, but she fell into everybody the tigers. Did, that, that's, that's what everybody said because the tiger's stomach digests everything so yeah, like, it's not gonna shit out no bones yeah. or anything like that you just gone dang yeah that's you know what's crazy like I saw an article the other day it said that probably like 10 years ago on the planet, there was probably a hundred, a hundred thousand uh, tigers. Mm. Now there's only twenty three, twenty three mm. thousand left. Listen, yeah. the, but the, the, the statistics on that show it showed that it showed that five to ten thousand tigers are held in captivity in mm-hmm. the U.S., but only four thousand are in the wildlife. And I'm like, but you know what's crazy to me? Crazy. Yeah, they got it captive. Once it get too big, just put it out in the wild. They shoot them. They but you, shoot but you know, at the same time though, they, they're uh, the wildlife is shrinking for these animals because yep. the human population is growing and they're taking up a lot of their space so you yep. have no choice but to put them in captivity nah I disagree or to so some extent the only wildlife gotta be like in the rainforests in Africa yeah, there's not you too you many can't, you can't build human places. life on that but. so we need to just, I don't know we need to do like the Chinese people and control population well, like oh, well, like not this. even <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> You said it no, but seriously, like I think it's messed up that we're really putting our needs in front of um, animals. animals. Like you feel me? Like that is their <clears throat> habitat. That's where they live. That is where they supposed to do them. Like true, but we human. Humans are, right. are selfish. All right, and you now. speak for yourself. <laughs> Tell the girl that's not gonna eat her man ass. Oh I'm my god! Ass. Or lick the dude. <laughs> we selfish. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm not. I'm <laughs> But to whoever her boyfriend is, sorry, pal, mm. we tried. 
But now, nah, look, Joe, right? Joe was a redneck gay guy, and he got he turned two street niggas gay. He was in the Tiger Things too. Yeah, no, that, that that's who the guy was. That he, was he's a Tiger King. king. He's a Tiger King. Oh, okay, okay. So he turned two gay guys gay. When I seen this, this nigga hey, got hold on. what? He turned what? he turned two straight guys gay. Cause he had bread. Yeah, he had bread. Yeah, he had he kept them like on drugs the whole time. And okay. made them stay in the um where they stayed on the site. Yeah, so he's gay too. He's yeah. gay. No, he's yeah. gay, he's but he turned gay, them gay. Okay. The so, two were, they were just out. going with the flow. Yeah. I guess. He turned them out a little bit. But see, I, I had to give him props because he like a turnout master. Yeah. He had so one nigga tattoo property of, of Joe. Joe. Whatever yeah, his name. It says something like Joe right on top of his meat. Like, yo, that's some real boss gay shit. Joe tagging it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, yeah, yeah, boy. Suicide, yeah, one of them, because no, he was held in. Yeah. No, I don't think that's what it is. He committed suicide because he wasn't really gay, and then the drug stopped. And then he had to deal with the reality, like, yo, I've been doing gay shit. I don't even think it's, it was just that. It was like, Joe wasn't really hearing come out in his needs. Like, you feel me? It's one, he had to stay there. He couldn't leave the site. Yeah. You feel me? Then he's doing stuff that he didn't want to really do. Well, he and then leave. he wasn't, because Joe wouldn't let him leave. Oh, so Joe was a dictator. Yeah, and then, yeah, in a way. And then on top of that, he said he wasn't getting Zeb as much as he no, was. No, they, 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 was on meth. No, that was on meth. Oh, meth? Oh, but no. they said Zeb. Meth will turn, yeah. yeah. turn you gay quick. Yeah, they lied. It, it, it was so, meth. You know, I guess it was like he wasn't. This, this is. It wasn't what he really wanted for himself. Yeah. He literally like you could see a clip where you can't see him yeah, do it, he, but you could see the flash of the gun yeah. go off. Really? Yeah. Dang. I think that's. I think he was dealing with reality at that point. Like, oh shoot, I've been dropping this neck on. <laughs> <laughs> but I think there was tops. So I don't think. I don't think. But that's but I don't think there was no racism. Joke. But that's what that's what white people do. You give them some drugs and they'll do anything. Oh, it's just a dick. Mm-hmm. Like, but I think I think they was the ones greasing him because he seemed more of the flem- the feminine. Oh, okay, okay. So I don't think he was. I don't. I think that's why it was it was so much easier for them to be gay because, like, okay, he giving me head. I just gotta fuck him. It's not the other way around. Oh, so Joe was the one getting it. Yeah. That's crazy. I don't know what that. I don't know. They, they don't give detail, but yeah, when he I looked, don't know where it was, how it, was it looked like he was the one okay. getting it. So it was. It was. I, I, I like Joe a little bit, kid. He was a crazy. I mean, right, that was a Floyd documentary. Yeah, he's the one that got the lawsuit now, right? He, he yeah. Jail with the right the picture, have you seen anybody? Is a white dude with like a mullet? Yeah, with the, the thing yeah. on his. He okay, tried to send him. the hit out on Carol. That's why he went to jail. He tried Carol's to kill still, him. So Carol's still alive. Carol's still booming, so. Oh, she's still booming. Yeah. The type of business. Yo, yeah. all of them snitched <laughs> on each other. It that was crazy. Here. But why they all couldn't just do one thing and eat together? Because Carol greedy. Selfish, greedy. It was times he was so close to like ending the beef with them that she do some green shit. But I think it was more like they don't. A lot of them don't care what they doing. It was just Carol. Like she yeah. was focused on shutting everybody, everybody else, else down, so she could be the only one. So she could be the only one. And they all was in the same state. No, that's the crazy part. Well, I think one was in Oklahoma. He was in Oklahoma, and then um, more of North South Carolina. I think Carol in Florida. I think she in Tampa. And Carol, was, she from Florida? No, she's not from Florida. Oh. Her thing, her little zoo thing is in Florida. But I think um, the Mexican looking guy. I don't oh, yeah, he's he down here too, but you can't even go on his shit. Why? Because he, he got his shit heavily guarded. No, you can oh. go. He has like a zoology. You can't go like on a wreck. You see when the documentary people try to go there the first time, they send him back. And then the nigga oh, had to yeah, get them yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Like but every person can just pull up to his yeah. shit. You like, have to have enough. You gotta have some bread and some stature. Huh? Somebody so, got vouch for so you. We, we gotta go one time. Yeah, we should. We should I, go. I, I, I'm gonna show you. Takashi was six nine. Mm-hmm. He did. He did have a video when he was playing like a baby yeah, tiger. Yeah. He's gonna be popular. Right back once he. Goes. I hope he is, and I hope he stays safe. Like. That's not a guarantee. Yeah. Uh, I you, just. You I guarantee. know, but I hope he does. Like, stay out these people's face. Like, if you gotta move, do you and your family. Like. I don't peg him as that type of guy. So would you? Would you want him for his next moves in life? Like, just low key. Yeah. You can. Just yeah, like you, you already, like you already out the game. Do Nobody he? gonna respect. We don't know. Cause remember, true. they was they was running his That's money. True. So we don't know how much he got left to like. God, remember, you already. Uh, got everybody accustomed to this lifestyle. So it's like, y'all can go all the way back. And then if he goes back, it's like, bro, everybody know who you are. You got these In tattoos. Opinion, he like, should just go right back to what he was doing before. The antics and music? Yep, antics, music, trolling. But I ain't gonna lie, he, I think he'll still be able to 
able to make bread though. Of course mm-hmm. it will. With who, the white who, folks. People love su- people love supporting uh who gonna put them on the song? It don't that don't matter, you can make his own music. Cause his music wasn't bad. Mm. It wasn't bad. It wasn't he had some cool. some hits that was you know sliding. I didn't listen to him. It wasn't too. Only that blicky um with the sticky um. No, it was exactly. decent. I didn't. Li- I personally didn't listen to it, but if it came on, I didn't get mad. That's what I'm saying. I can't even tell you a six nine song. Exactly. I know the one with him and a boogie. That shit was hard. Yeah, the one he did with Nicki too. He got oh yeah, the one with Nicki was hard too. Fifi. Yeah, Fifi. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> that that one wasn't bad, but I don't. <clears throat> I don't. The rap game will accept him. Listen, if, I believe I like if he go if he comes out and does the same stuff again, he's gonna make money too. It's just people will lose a lot. People have lost a lot of respect for him, so it's gonna be hard for him to get his name out there like it used to. But he's gonna make money. He's gonna go right back. I wish go people right weren't like so like follow. <laughs> what was it? what is it? Follow the leader? No, like monkey see monkey do. Monkey see monkey do ish. <laughs> like, cause like. Everybody just like, go. Oh, he's a snitch. He's a guarantee. He's a snitch. Mm-hmm. But what he me did what he did. Too. Like, move on from that. Who cares? That's not your life. People be so mm. consumed in other people's lives. True. Like, that's, that's true. True. Just live your. What's celebrities? Life. It's more like a celebrity thing. Exactly. Yeah. But nine times out of ten, half the dudes, not even half, more than half of the dudes, if they was put in his situation, they do the same exactly. exact thing. So how gonna But you ain't down. in the situation to fold, so don't nobody know. Never fold. Never but then I was looking at someone, and they were like, if he didn't snitch. I don't think any of them would have like went to jail for that amount of, that amount of time. Yeah, but he was not gonna get out. That's so yeah, he was gonna get out, out at all. Hell no. Saying like a canoe. He was gonna. <laughs> what if he had to do only like three years? Like if if you put in that predicament. All right, like I think he probably. Oh, that's cake. That's cake for but real. But that's what I think it was gonna be looking like. He probably did three to five. No, I think they was. He was, trying he to was get about to get about thirty some. Yeah, but everybody else that got all those years are only because he testified. If he doesn't oh, testify. True, yeah. Then nobody get those. You know, yeah, that's but, not, but if he didn't testify, those gonna hit him with all yeah. the charges. You gotta have the it's proof. Either me or you, and it ain't gonna be me. No, I think he just scared. Yeah. Cool. I think he could have bucked. I think that whole thing was set up. I they think knew who they was really after, and they just used him. To, Use him to, to testify and then yeah. get him all the music. Look at Bobby Smurder. If he would have snitched, <laughs> he would have got what well, I think five. But that's different. Don't his homies. niggas. Yeah, that's just Bobby yeah. riding for his niggas. That's no, a listen, different story. I'm a, if it's, it's one thing, two things about it. Mm. If when Bobby get out, he ain't more popular than six nine. I know something. Okay. You understand? Too. I know something. You understand? Too. Cause he legit took more years so Rowdy could get less. And it's crazy part. We that's probably, real. We probably not even gonna fuck with him for real. For real. No, I like his music. I like his music, but. Takashi might be. But he only had one. No, no, no. I like the other no, one. Like the no, I don't know. No, I don't know. I like that one. They got Bobby. Bobby. Like Bobby. 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 They should big it up. It's, it's up to him. If he make good music, he's going to pop. Yeah, but... But if he's not, then if that's he up to him. Music, that's good. He got to get yeah, another reason Takashi was so popular is because the dumb shit he do. One, he, he from New funny. York. Mm-hmm. The colorful hair. The minute you see a nigga colorful hair, you're like, oh, why is this nigga so relevant? And he was funny. I didn't like him. I didn't like him when he, he first funny. came out. Like, the, the hair and everything didn't attract me. But if you know so you me... Don't play with me. <laughs> if you know me, you know I love to laugh. Like... That is so my funny. thing. So and he's funny. funny. What made me love him was that <laughs> video that he had. He came down co- the stairs. Copying um, 50 Cent. He had the, the <laughs> headphones. <laughs> go, go shine. He had the headphones. Tap oh, yeah, off the tape on his chest. Yeah, it was one video where he came down the stairs with these big Tims on. Nice. And big pants and a big ass white tee. Probably like a 6X. No, it's, it's the he's video. Funny, man. It's the video when um, he, he was. Like, they was interviewing him. Not interviewing him, but the news people was on him. They was like, yeah, spit a, spit a, spit a line for us. <laughs> he like, I, I got y'all. Y'all, going, y'all listening? He like, these bitches love so, 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's like a <laughs> people cheap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His troll level is on 100, man. cheap, I was dying. His troll level is on 100. It's on uh-huh. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. he was beefing with a legend, though, low key. That's but that's why because he knew who he had in his corner. Yeah, like bro, Chief Keep is like a 
People don't really give him respect because he just ain't been dropping shit like that. Yeah, he's what Chicago, I mean? Chicago niggas. He's respected. Yeah. But he's like a legend. No, it will be no G Herbal, no nobody from Chicago, no Chief Keef. Chief Keef was hard. He was. That first album. But you remember, it. remember after they beefed, though, Chief Keef flew to um, New York yeah. to go find Kid. He was really on that. He really on that. I yeah. heard Chief Keef got about like 10 kids. Yeah, and all, all different baby moms. Oh, that's I wanted crazy. that in life, y'all boys. No lie. I used to want that when I was younger. Okay, we ain't know no better. <laughs> but tell me, I ain't gonna lie to you, if I grew like him and I had the money, I would have did it. No, that's too much. That's, that's too much. much to keep problem. it tracked up. Yeah. Like, it's easy. Who, which kid belongs to who? <laughs> like, no, no, it's you got the money. It's easy. Straight. All they want is the money, bro. Straight. You get a house. You get a car. You get a house. You get a car. You get a house. Everybody needs it. Straight. I don't Come know on. what happened to his music though, but. Everybody nah, but it. he 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 gonna drop some gems every now and then. What was the last gem he dropped? Yeah, what was the last one? I mean, I don't know. The last one I liked was Fanito. Yeah. What's that? Fanito. No, I don't See? know. Exactly. I like going, I'm in a gorilla in a suit. Uh, what the? I yeah, like that, that one. one. Too. That's yeah. it. After that, I don't know nothing. That's, else. Wait, that's Fanito. Oh, that's the name of it? Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know the name. Put <laughs> pull, pull up in the suit. But he had another one. What? Nah, I don't remember it right now, but it's Finito and another one. I don't know. That was the last one I liked. That was the last one. That's the only one the I like. The one with the beagle off. He, yeah, that's it. That's Finito. That's, I guess. That's not, is it? That's the one with the gorilla in the zoo. Go off? Yeah, oh. that's yeah. it. That's I heard you do that sneaky time. You yeah. heard? Yeah. You heard? Yeah, he good. That one's lit. Hood, but listen, the best one from Chicago is Lil Dirk, though. That's that's my dog right there. I like Dirk, you. I like I ain't gonna lie. I like her. Come on, man. I put you on. You. you put me on, I gotta give credit. Right. I like Herbal. Yeah. Herbal good, but uh, that, that off the beat thing, yeah. I can't rock with that, man. I, I used to, I used to then rock with it either, but he, he be spitting though. I he think be I only you know one. Do. I'll give him that. He do. I know he one G Herbal song, and I don't, <laughs> even, one? I don't even really know it. What's up? All I know is I'm rolling, I'm rolling, I'm rolling, I'm rolling, I'm rolling. Yeah. That was hard. You know something that um, Lisa brought to my attention the other day, hmm. which blew my mind. You know his baby mama Ari Fletcher. Yeah. Mm-hmm. She does not make any music. No. But she you know, she's known it. just because that's his being. Yeah. Without that him, blew no her. Mind, bro. Yeah. I did not know that. I thought she made that's music like or Uchi. she was a stripper or something. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She got on because of Yeah, Chris no crew. No Chris Brown. That is Chris. crazy. The Shade Room post her like religiously crazy. every week, bro. She but I think though. she does her own stuff she now. She bodied though. Like her body? It's, yeah, I don't know. Nobody would have a store bought body, man. Nah, I think that's a natural. No, it's not. Oh. Uh, her titties yeah, can't right. be. I don't know. She said her butt is, but I think her titties are fake. Uh, I can take a fake titty. I don't care about no. no I don't no. care about. So you wouldn't take no fake titties? For, for, from a girl? Yeah. I don't care about I no mean, fake titties. If that's what your damn gift If that's what she want, I mean, yeah, but I like my girls natural. Me too, but I'll take some fake titties. You're a pretty stand up guy. Come on, man. Come on. He's a stand up guy. But I'm sitting down. <laughs> yeah, I was going. I, I thought that in my head. I was like, I'm not gonna say it. I don't want to make you feel bad. But I take. I take. I, take, I, I, take I, I used to be like one of those girls who wanted her body done. So really? I wow. What kind of work you do? I had my daughter. Hold them. I like yeah, this. You have a daughter? Yes. Oh, her name is Shia Baby Angie. Hey. Well, I shouldn't have. Well, yeah. whatever. <laughs> Everybody knows Shia <laughs> if you know me. But yeah. Whatever. But okay, you wanted your body done. Why? After I had my daughter, like. You know, after you have a baby as a female, your mm. body goes through dramatic changes that you just oh, cannot shoots. come back from. Mm. <laughs> like, so I ain't gonna lie, I was like, still today, sometimes I get real insecure about my body. Like, so I wanted my boobs done. Like, mm. but then, like, a couple of years ago, I went on, like, my own journey, T spiritual, like, mm. and just, like, spending time with myself and I started eating right and doing a lot of stuff mm. and then I started really loving myself more and sometimes like well not sometimes now I'm for sure for certain know like I'm straight like I wouldn't do that to myself but why your boobs what did what did she do to your boobs oh I breastfed for a year and a half like, so what was the like what's the bad side effect I, I believe in it too saggy. yeah I believe in it I think you should I think Breast lift is possible. If you have, if you had kids, for nah, it's just you, you just gotta no, no, find the love for yourself, and you should also be with someone who uplifts you and lets you know. I'm, I'm you should know yourself, but 
You should also. So, I'm saying, so, so what were you going to do? You want to get implants or breast lift? Because no. breast lift just lift it back up. Yeah, I'm mm-hmm. okay with that, but Black. actual implants, no. Nah. Yeah. No, nah, I don't want nothing done, though. I'm saying at the time, what you wanted done. I wanted, like, bigger boobs. Like, wh- whatever to fix it is what I wanted. I wasn't really trying to specify on either if I okay, should okay. get a lift or mm. implants. It was just like, whatever if I could get it had. back to how it did when I was in high school, <laughs> that's the goal. <laughs> but, the golden days. <laughs> but now, right? Bro, look. I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm like, oh, Bro, like, because when I had my daughter, it was just like, I felt like I wasn't out there. Like, I was an experience, and then I just lost my body. Like, I'm like, yeah, yeah. let me tell you. I used to be in high school. Yeah, yeah be, like. Ninth grade, be greasing this girl, right? She had a nice ass body. Like, her titties was perfect. No shirt. Natural. Shirt. Natural. It just, boom. I used to love it. Then she gonna get pregnant by somebody else. Not me. She got pregnant by somebody else. So I'm like, oh, you ruined it. Like, we was having good sex. Did she come back and have sex with me after? I was like, well, uh, the titties dropped. And I'm like, oh. You see, it's niggas like, that's the, that's like, the, that's like, what like, happens. That's uh, natural. That's it was natural, but I'm like. But that is what makes us, a lot of female insecurities, it comes from our self, but at most of the time, we're trying to, like, damn, he not going, he not going to be satisfied with yeah, how I, I look. I was hurt. So that's where it comes from, That too, was the golden but, days. It was good. Like, what's happening? She had the. Nah, but sometimes I be like, nah, you you fine, you fine, you good. But sometimes you you is fine. But I would never be like, I want to go get my body done. I would rather work it out. That's why I have a problem with that. I would rather you work it out. Too. Yeah, you, you can work out to get it to a certain you extent. Really I'd rather you work it out, but. Breast lift, I can I can be okay with a breast lift. Yeah, All you're doing is like your chili guy said you want to put so it in the extra yeah. yeah, that's it. But it's like you want to get implants? 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 No. no. Get your ass done? No. Yeah. Stomach out? But I don't know if they're stomach? ripping no. like, because I, I remember, um, I think they're saying breast reductions. Like, I believe, I, I think when that's you get cool. Yeah, implants, that's because someone that's bad and it hurts your back. Yeah. When you get implants, like, they cut some glands, I think, where, where yeah. you're supposed to produce I think you do anything. Milk. Oh, I don't know about that. So that's why they say, like, you, you're not supposed to breastfeed after you get, you get implants? implants. Oh, I don't know. I didn't yeah. know that. But, but I don't know. You know, the world evolves so much, they always find a way where to. you can do everything. Like Yeah, like even with the kids, this shit's crazy. So you might still be able to breastfeed after getting an implant. Like my third child, if I, after my third child, if my second child is a girl, my third child, I'm paying for it. Like I'm not even taking that risk. Oh, you want to? So you want a boy? Yeah, hell yeah. But so if, how much kids do you want? I want five. Five. I want six. I want a big family too. Yeah. Me too. Oh, but I want an odd number. I want three. That's not, that's not a big. That's family. not big. There's five people in the house. <laughs> oh, yeah, that ain't that big though. That's average. Ah, uh, so big. <laughs> well, I like coo- I like coops. <laughs> You just look at your coop. Get your webs. Get your coop. Hey, get that mini van. Oh, that's the last thing I want to do. I'm getting a truck. Get that suburban zone. We're going to get a truck. Or somebody. Suburban. Go I'll be there. Or we're going to have two cars in the, in, the, in the house. Well, that's mandatory to have two cars in the house. I want like three. I want four of my damn yeah. uh, <laughs> I want my personal one. She said two, get in. two is mandatory. Well, I'm not, yeah. I'm not a car person, so. See, but you want six of them? <laughs> yeah. No, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind five though. How far you want them apart? I want five, but I want. Like, I mean, I, I want minimum right two. Right now, I feel apart. so bad for my daughter because she's she's five, about to be six, and she's that's just, not bad. You got a long one, hood. Yeah, she's full of dough. Yeah. It is bad. Like I'm I saying, when you start again, it's not gonna be bad. Like yeah. she's gonna be able to help. I saw you saying she was cutting her bread, getting her juice by Bro, herself. It's like kids do stuff out of nowhere, and True. you just really be like. When did this happen? True when did day. I miss this? Like, it literally happens, like, overnight. Like, she don't even ask me for nothing anymore. Like, she just, I see her in the fridge. I see her climbing the counter. So it's a blessing and a curse. Yeah. Because it's good you ain't got to do it no more, but it's like, dang, I miss her asking me. I don't miss her asking me. <laughs> <laughs> you miss the baby? I ain't going to lie, quarantine got me going crazy with Shia right now, okay? You miss the- I hear, mommy, mommy, can I use the bathroom? Go use the bathroom. <laughs> Dang, that's tough, man. Yeah, but you—they so—they're funny. I like they're, the baby stage funny. though. 
Yeah. But I know my first child is going to be a girl, man. Just watch the, uh, the girl. Not, got you. Uh, Not that I have a problem with it, because yeah. I'm happy with whatever God gives me, mm. but I want a boy first. Yeah. Why? I be feeling like when you have a boy first, it's because you you in a good relationship you're supposed to be in, and the man is great. No. Nope. So you, know, you, know, sure. you know what they say? Yes. 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 You know what they say? Yes. When a girl has a boy first, it's because she was a She's explicitive. A She's and if a boy has a girl first, it's because no. he was a explicitive. So if she has a girl first, what? That means she was a explicit in a girl first? Listen, he, he being, he using me words. She was a hoe. Listen, if, if the girl has, has a boy, boy first, she's a hoe. She's, she was a hoe. Okay. If the boy has a girl first, if a dude he has was a, a girl first, then he was a hoe. It's to go exactly revenge. Yeah. Supposedly. So what if we have a girl first? What that mean? You, you okay. You wasn't there. Yeah. If a girl has a gang, gang, girl first, she was a hoe. But. So that tells you something I, I about Marx. No, I don't agree with that. Because <laughs> if I can remember correctly, hold on. You have a daughter. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that is true. Okay. So. That was a hoe. Once upon a time, that was a hoe. That was a hoe. That was a hoe. Mind you, I know a hoe to be a garden tool. Who? Yeah, yeah, for real. I don't know that, 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 was, that, that word is non-existent. Yes, it means okay. big on that word. Yeah. I, was a, I was a bachelor. Respect women, please. How you was a bachelor? <laughs> not a bachelor. I Because I was living my best life. I had a lot of people. I had 30 You were not looking for love. No, not at all. I had 30 people at one time. I, I, I was thinking about this stuff. They had 30 people at one time. This was all in your high school years? Yeah. Jesus Christ. 30 people, yeah. You felt like the man. You I loved like... it. Oh my God, I loved it. I love it. It was you fun, kid. Man, I was thinking about I had sex with people I could probably walk by and don't even remember. That's how bad it was. Oh. That's tough. <laughs> like, I That's thought you was going to say that you could walk by and just not say nothing no, to me. He said, remember. Like, remember. No, because it was like, it would be like, I met you Monday. We talked for like two weeks. I agreed. I'm like, ah. I don't care about you no more. I never spoke to you again. And that's why he has a daughter. <laughs> what? <laughs> but I put my daughter on point. That's why I be like, why people be scared? Like, yo, I'm gonna get my the game early. Like, yo. But that's another reason why I don't want a daughter first, because this world is just unforgiving, man. Like, with the way, like, I don't even, I was talking to a coworker the other day, and we was talking about, you know, having kids and stuff, because he already has kids, but he has two boys. And this is like, with a daughter, it's just so different, like, it is. You gotta watch who you let run your kids. You gotta Big facts. all types of stuff. Yeah. Big facts, yeah. yeah. Like I saw a twelve year old girl walking home the other day from school mm. before the quarantine started. I'm like, damn, she's like twelve or thirteen. I would man. not let my kid I'm not walk cool home. With that. And this day and age, <laughs> no, hell no. No, none of this. I'm sorry. My, I get dropped off. But everybody has different circumstances. Yeah, I wouldn't. I was walking from school at like. I'm gonna grade. work my way around her. Like, yeah, I can't do that's it. That's why I'm working now to like. For, for when it matters, your mama's gonna be there exactly. picking you up, dropping you off every single day. Even my brother, I don't wanna walk home from school. She he, won't. he just turned 18. Oh, hold on, hold on. Why you want your brother walking from school? Because, bro, it's just like, there's no. These people that kidnap people, they're not gender specific. <laughs> they don't <laughs> care. They're not gender specific or age oriented. Mm. So it's like, no matter if you look like a victim, we're gonna take you. Mm, that's and it's a good like point. a boy has a better chance of maybe getting away, but it's like they prey on women, little mm. girls. It's like when you have a girl, mm. you gotta be so careful. With a boy, it's the same thing. With all kids, you all gotta kids. be careful. Yeah. But it's like with a girl, you, you gotta, gotta be, be careful who she's around, yeah. who watches her, yeah. what That's she's a doing. Big who watches social her. media, big influence. Mm-hmm. What she's doing on social media, who she's talking to on social media. It's just like, see, like, dang. I have a daughter, so I don't know. I I feel like putting her on point early. I wanted a girl first. Let me start with that, cause with a boy, you gotta be tough. Like with a girl, I never got to really show emotion. So I feel like, oh, my daughter, I could be the first one and I'm learning to do it. That could be the first person that I give it to. Right now, unconditionally. with my daughter, at a, like, I think since she was three, like, I, I taught her, like, bro, like, if somebody touch you or anything yeah, happens, yeah. you come to your mom. You you tell me first. Yeah, that's the thing. A lot of kids be scared to, to you. tell you that. Yeah. That's, got- that's, like, I <laughs> think you're just thing. in the that shit is position where... A lot of us experience things for the first time and don't know. Yeah, you don't know how to react. How to handle it. Yeah, so. cause and then they never had to talk. You right? I want to. So I want to have it early with my jit too, cause it's like. I, at first, I was having a conversation with the mother of my child, and I was like, she was like, oh, we gotta be very specific, like, tell them dick, pussy. Yeah, I, I do that with my daughter. 
I, and I was I like, don't say those. I say vagina. Yeah, like, yeah but, come on. Was, but she knows right. she'll say like vagina. But I'll be like, don't go to your school. Yeah, yeah. Your <laughs> friend's vagina. vagina. <laughs> you just know that there's a vagina, yeah, exactly. there's a penis. She was I like, feel like younger kids so, don't really know if something is if if something happens. Oh yeah, I gotta go tell my parents. Like, no, if but, somebody touches you inappropriately. But the thing is, you'll be you should know. You would know as a that's parent. Right. But some parents don't know. Some parents will be around. I feel like that's that's it be a knock on a parent. Can't you be sh- around. That's but true. even if you can't be around, you should know your shit. Cause like if something like that happened to them, they change. Yeah, like, they do. They're not gonna be the same. They show. For like a couple uh-huh. weeks, it's gonna take a while before it like you notice. Not everybody <laughs> processes things. It depends the same. on what it is. Yeah, not not all kids are gonna react the same. And they don't even it don't necessarily be like touching in a bad way. Like mm. some people's intentions. Oh, I just want to touch her back. I'm gonna use okay, that example. Right, yeah. That's their way of. Oh yeah, that's my you know my high. Yeah. But. Your child won't think nothing of it. They're not gonna be like, oh, hey, mommy, daddy, something just touched my back today. True. You feel me? It's like, you just never know. And, and a lot of times, it's people that you're around, people that they're around on a normal basis. That's, mm-hmm. very that's the that's crazy scary part. part. Yeah. Very, very, that's the crazy very part. And it's like, true. I know somebody who told me, like, if they, they had a step that you just beat me in front of them. That's crazy. And I was like, bro. damn. It's like, like, you just said that is true. Like, that that's not gonna really change you like to the point you you sad or you and a lot of in you in emotion moods because you just seen that but it's like that's crazy. A lot of time in the moment it doesn't really like Register. you don't know what's going on but it takes years for you to start feeling some type of way mm. or you have nightmares or you can't really recover from it and you mm. don't know why you acting crazy. Oh, yeah. And it's trauma. Yeah. You experienced a form of trauma that you didn't even know was really something yeah my next my next person pulling up y'all boys she's a uh she's an advocate into um stuff like that she gonna be elaborating and um That's things good. like that and stuff like that so y'all boys stay tuned her name is veronica we just got deep a little bit yeah but yeah we did you need to you need to something else i wanted to ask y'all boys go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. okay um, what's your take on Dwayne wade and his son mm. <sighs> me i feel like I feel like God made man, God made <laughs> woman, woman man, that's it. and that's it. Be, that's but it. it's not my place to bash this man's family. Like, it's none of our place yeah, of to our pass place. judgment but the thing on is, this man's family or make fun of his child because at the end of the day, this is all on social media and he, he he's going to see it. Yeah. Like, even if it's what they decide to bring out to the table, hmm. there are a lot of kids or people that's going through what his son is going through mm. and they're killing themselves or being killed. Wow. So at the end of the day, everybody need to mind their business. But, but, that's but, 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 this, this is like the understanding. Mad no, 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 no. And See, women. all that was cute. I'm telling you. No, no, no. So if and your child was like that, you if be you cute with son, it. Yeah, if your son was like that, how you handling it? Um, that please forbid. Yeah. I would, God yeah. Forbid. For me, um, so you guys are asking if this was him. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. If your son was just, he comes to you like, yo, I want to be a girl. I mean, I'll try to handle it the best way possible, but at the end of the day, if he made his, his decision, I hmm. can't. Would you be okay with it? I can't say that I would really be okay with it. I won't be okay, but I would have to accept it. Yeah, you got to accept it. See, that's yeah. why I keep telling people. Like, when I was telling people, I... I dove into it a little bit I forgot episode I forgot which one it was one of these episodes and I was like if my son was like that first of all I don't want him to be the girl so if he was gay <laughs> if he was gay well, bro, you really you really think outside the box well, yeah, this is an outside <laughs> this is, I wouldn't want my son to, to be, be the, the, the yeah, bottom like, but exactly I don't want my son taking dick no get a dick out bro you still got one but if he wanted to be that just don't be too out there with it, like, like, yeah, just, there, just, there is gay people that's yeah. many, oh, yeah. yeah, like, just, just yeah. take it easy out, oh, like, take it easy. <laughs> 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 if you want to be like that, people, just don't do it in front of that. When you go to my crib out and I'm around you, just tone it down, don't, don't do all that extra stuff, like, still just chill with me. Would like, you I get, no, nah, I get that's you, but just vibe with me for real, for real. And it's like, just still act normal, like a guy, like, like sports because I'm gonna force sports on but, you. But here's the thing though. 
Dwayne's son isn't claiming that he, he wants to be gay. He's saying that he's a woman. No, he thinks he's a he's, he's, That's he's what I'm saying. That's the difference from being gay. He's transgender. Being gay means you're like, boys, what you're transgender. What do you mean his transgender has he, he, he feel like his gender is wrong. That's what yeah, transgender means. Yeah, that's what means. it is. He yeah. wants to be a woman yeah. in a male body. It, that's what I'm saying. Even mm-hmm. though you feel like that, don't I do it wrong. I thought to be considered transgender, you have to no, you don't have to. the person. No, nobody, listen. Okay, no, to, to be considered transgender, you have to actually have... Done it. Nope. Okay. Nope. Yeah, That's boys. what it is. I'm gonna tell y'all. I've been I've been doing my research. I went through every letter. Transgender. You don't go through with anything. That's just how you feel. That's how you want to be identified. Because when you go through with anything, you lose your sexual feelings. Like if a guy get a vagina, he's dead. There's no more getting on heart. There's no more nothing. No sensation for him. He can't catch a nut. Nothing. So they just identify like that, but they still keep the dick. Yeah. yeah. I didn't I know that. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Nobody nobody actually gets rid of it. Like even with girls when they want to be guys, they can't go get a dick. They got to keep it scrap. And I was asking a question like that today like do they get fucked? I seen I literally seen a transgender guy and a transgender girl having a baby. That is crazy. And I feel like that makes sense. It's an abomination. No, nah, how? <laughs> that's a man and a woman. But that's not how God made you. No, he did he did make them God like that. God didn't make them with implants and booty, big fat. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's an that. abomination, too, <laughs> man. But, yeah. doctors gotta Y'all wouldn't be able to deal with that more? Doctors, doctors gotta eat. Y'all so wouldn't be able to deal with that more, though? Like, yeah, if what? my son was, he wanted to be a girl, but he dates a girl that's dressed like a guy. Like, imagine the way Wade's son gets with a, like, a, a transgender guy. Oh, so you've done this dating, the, the original gender is a woman. Yes. yes. But she just looks like a dude. Yes. It's still in the bond but it's okay because it's a woman. It's, it's actually the right. You're still doing it the right way. And to me, that's why I feel like people should do. Because you, this person that also thinks they wrong. But yeah. the intentions are wrong, though. The no only way. reason you're with that person is because of the dude figure. Not because of what's in their pants. That's you know fine. What I mean? That's fine. Cause, yeah, it's, cause, it's more acceptable. Because we're gay, is just more... To me, gay is a chemical imbalance. Like, you're more feminine to me, and you're more flamboyant. I don't think you have to... I think society puts those boxes on people that make you gay. Like, if a guy is super flamboyant, everybody keeps saying, oh, you gay, you gay, you gay, you gay. Then soon that he just go do gay shit, and you're like, I'm gay. But it's like, you're super flamboyant. This girl is super... Like, she super manly. So, like, why y'all just get together? It's like the chemical imbalance, like, your shit didn't get... You didn't get all your manly side. Fine. She didn't get all her feminine side. Fine. Y'all get together. Not you just gonna be gay because ah. of that. But then, but then it gets deeper where the dude, I don't want a man, I want a penis. And that woman that's manly can't give him that. Scrabble. Well, hey, well. <laughs> they got heated. They got heated straps. But I, I can say I think yeah, yeah, they got um, a lot. for Dwayne Wade's son, he's very young and they're moving too fast for him. Mm, nope, they yes. know. Kids know. I know yeah, a gay person. He yeah, told me you, he knew. Yeah, you know, but knew. like it's that whole situation is just no. How you handle it? You ain't if, if like I mean, it yeah. To, <laughs> to be honest with you, for my son to come to me and tell me that my God is wrong. Yeah. By making giving me a son and you think you're a woman, yeah. I'm not okay with that. I can't be okay with it. So you you're not gonna deal, are you are you gonna deal with them? Like you just deal I have with no them? choice. That's my seed. Okay. I can't I can't I can't kill them. So that's I can't return them. I think we I so can't do none of that. So what you do? Like basically that's all the way Wade is doing. Like I can't return. I can do this. So I'm just gonna go with what they going with. Now nah, I'm gonna keep it a buck. Me personally, mm. I can't. I can't go with it. But that's me speaking not being in that situation at the yeah. moment. Because when I'm in the moment, you feel me, it might be totally different. Mm-hmm. But right now, I can't I can't go with that. Mm-hmm. And you can't you can't live in my roof saying, oh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a female and you're a dude. Yeah, I, see. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I can't yeah, walk Yeah, I ain't addressing you as no girl. That's just I'm me. Sorry. I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> Wait, what, if, what if when they get out and they do it? So they was like... Oh, if you're grown, that's, that's your business. Are you going to address them as a girl? Oh, when they go out with yeah. me? No, no. <laughs> they hit 18. I'm out, Dad. Uh, but I'm a girl. Okay. Uh, call me uh, Jadaya. Oh, no. I'm still calling you what I birthed you with. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> That's not I what I'm going to give you a birth certificate. Uh, what no. you say to me? Absolutely not. Oh. Are we, we still... <laughs> We're still going, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I, well, this is off topic. This is going back to um, coronavirus. Mm, good. So... I just feel like everyone should not take this lightly, you know? Mm -hmm. I think everyone should be practicing social distancing and taking this serious because a lot of people have um, grandparents 
or mm-hmm. other Elderly. family members who are losing their lives to this and we shouldn't be selfish like it shouldn't take fit it to happen to us directly for us to be affected or true um feel the pain or whatever yeah so practice social distancing <clears throat> and take this serious y'all take, boys y'all boys take it serious um let me wrap that thing up y'all boys this is the end of episode 10 y'all boys that and was a good uh-huh. i did a good rap uh, let me see, let me see it, do you? No, y'all go first and I'm gonna go last. Oh, uh, oh, that's your rap? Okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, I don't, oh, I, don't, I, don't I don't usually do anything. Oh, you, oh you're actually rapping again. Yeah. He's actually rapping again. That's okay, never mind. Yeah. But yeah, let's wrap this episode up, y'all boys. Um, Make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, do all that thing. You feel me? Follow Outside the Box. Outside dot the box on Instagram. Subscribe to the YouTube channel Outside the Box, and y'all boys stay tuned. You know we got more episodes coming up, more interviews. You feel me? I'm, I'm jumping into that interview back, so y'all boys stay ready. You feel me? And it's a wrap.